Alicia and secret boyfriend just got here. Don't be throwing like the most shade in the beginning of this video. <laughs> Friday, June 24th, the day before my birthday. I'm in such a good mood today. I don't know. I'm just like so excited because I have a very fun day planned. I am going into work, but I do have a tennis lesson today, which is super exciting. And I'm literally forcing my friends to go with me, which will be amazing. My tennis lesson isn't until noon, so I kind of have all morning to like get my shit together a little bit because I am having my party here tomorrow and I have a bunch of like packages, the decor, and all of the things being delivered. And I want to show you all some of the stuff that I got. Slay. First of all, how fucking adorable are these teas I got from Amazon? Literally so funny. They're just so cute. I pretty much got all of my decor from Amazon and then I like ordered balloons. Alicia's in charge of the cake. I don't know, I'll tell you where everything's from. I like got mini golf carts. So grateful for all the brands that agreed to like send me stuff. Stella Artois sent me a bunch of beer. So we've got the booze, we got the activities. Things are coming together, baby. I just unfortunately have to clean. I slept in self-tanner last night because I've been trying to like gradually tan myself over the week for my party. Unfortunately, I was lazy and only slept in a t-shirt. Therefore, I got spray tan quite literally all over my sheets. So... This is gross. And why is it pink? Like... Spray tan check. Sorry, this is like probably TMI, but if you get spray tans, you know. I feel like girls always freak out about guys having like navy sheets, me included, because it's like, oh my God, he's not a man yet. Like every fork boy has navy sheets, blah. But sometimes, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, like I love when they have navy sheets because then I don't have to worry about my spray tan coming off like this. Like that is the most embarrassing thing in the world. Me getting self tanner on someone else's bed, like not even my own, new fear unlocked. Let's clean her. I've been putting this color wow dream cocktail coconut infused hair shit in my hair It smells so forking good like literally like the beach reminds me of Florida is to help with dry straw like hair Which I feel like my hair gets like that at the bottom I'm so excited to start like actually decorating for my birthday because that's the best part I just got to do some like chores first and then I'll be able to have fun and go banane with the decor Let's clean these sheets Y'all don't even know how excited I am to clean my sheets this time though. Because I got some new ones. From Brooklinen. Like this is so epic. If y'all have been watching me for some time now and watched me move into this apartment, I started fresh so I bought like a new bed. We did the new mattress. Of course I had to get new sheets and a duvet cover and y'all know I got my duvet cover from Brooklinen because Obviously I had to. I am so thrilled to be saying that this video is sponsored by them. Like what the heck is life bro? Like I bought this with my own money. When stuff like this happens, it's just so crazy to me. I'm like, this is bananas. I'm just so excited to put on my new sheets for my birthday vlog, you know what I mean? Okay, let's do the damn thing. So I personally love Brooklyn and so much because they have the most luxury, high quality sheets that you can get, but for an affordable price. I remember when I moved into this apartment and I was shopping for all of the things and necessities that I needed, including bed sheets and duvet cover and all of the things. I was looking for luxury sheets sheets. I really wanted to make my room like the most comfortable place that I have ever been in, in my entire life. Like I wanted to invest in really nice sheets and just make sure that this place was like my oasis because y'all know I'm always on the go and I just wanted to like be able to fully relax and like sleep so well when I'm in my room. And Brooklinen, y'all, trust me, they have the best quality and the best pricing and that's all I look for in literally anything. Quality and a good price. Like Boom, we got a baby, Brooklyn. And currently unboxing my new Luxe Core set. Slay. This is everything. It's giving what it needs to give. Forget the not having navy sheets. Like, he can have navy sheets as long as they're Brooklyn. And you know what I mean? Pillowcases. Oh my god, I just realized this is a new duvet cover. 
Slay. I mean, this one I already love and it's Brooke Linen, but so excited. And then their core sheet set. It comes with one flat sheet, one fitted sheet, two pillowcases, and the best sleep of my life. Slay. Comment down below if you have a top sheet because I know it was like a little trend for a moment of people not having it and I think that's a little bizarre personally. So the classic and luxe hardcore bundles are usually priced between $200 and $250 just depending on what size of bed you have. But if you compare that price to other luxury sheets, it's literally $500, like minimum. It's crazy. Also, fun fact, they literally have over 100,000 five-star reviews. Probably one including me because I was so obsessed when I purchased this. I'm currently trying to get like 10,000 five-star reviews on my podcast, like 100,000? Also, not only are the sheets comfy AF, but they have 20 plus colors you can choose from. So if you want your navy, by all means, go get your navy, go get your man's navy, whatever. But they have a gazillion other colors that you can choose from. So you can literally make any color combo you want. So instead of buying just one individual item, I definitely recommend the hardcore bundle. As I said earlier, I got the luxe one. If you get it in a bundle, it's 25% off compared to if you were to get everything individually. So if any of y'all are interested in checking out Brooklinen or buying anything from there, use my code TaylorK for $20 off your first purchase. If you spend over $100, it is a great deal. And I definitely recommend that Lux Hardcore set because you're already saving. Plus my code TaylorK, you'll get the $20 off and Boom, new bedroom check, new Lux hotel feeling check, and I hope you all enjoy your new sheets. Oh, forking socks. They really do feel like a hotel. Wow. Should I wash these before I put them on? Let me call my mom. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic- I also call my dad. Oh yeah. Hey, I just got brand new sheets in the sheets in a duvet cover in the mail. Do I have to wash them before I put them on my mattress? Yeah, you should. I should? Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah. Even if they're brand new? Yeah. Okay, I'll wash them. Bye. 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 This is like buttery and just like, I don't know how else to say other than it feels like a hotel. Meanwhile, while my sheets wash, trying to debate who I'm gonna bring to this Revolve 4th of July party because last year, I'm not kidding you, it was the best party that I've ever been to in my entire life. And I was thinking about bringing this boy that I liked, but he's just like not treating me right. And I'm like, you don't deserve to come to the best party of the year. Like, I'm sorry, no. So I'm gonna bring Julia. She's gonna be way more fun anyway. I just texted her, let's see what she says. <gasps> she said, stop, I'd be honored. Yay! It's gonna be so fun. I'm so excited. Also, that means me bringing a girlfriend, I can meet a better, hotter, more nice guy that'll treat me right. Slay at the party because there's so many hot guys. This is where I literally met Drake last year. Like, I'm sorry, did you hear that? Drake, sucks for him, rocks for Julia. This is what you get for being an amazing friend and editor and nice overall human being. Invitations to cool ass parties in LA. Not me throwing like the most shade in the beginning of this video. Okay, clearly I'm fired up. I washed my sheets and I dried them and now my hair is almost done being dry and now the lighting in my room is weird. So ignore that, but let's put these on my bed. Wow, it literally looks and feels so forking good. Like, it's buttery. Feels exactly like a bougie ass hotel. Like, nice, like five star hotel. I'm sorry, like, look how sleek that tuck is. These are incredible. I don't want to get up, but I need to get ready. This is what I'm wearing to play tennis. Aloe hat, outdoor voices, Puma shoes. Hey guys, okay, I'm going to tennis with the tennis pro that I have been like training with. I forking love tennis and it, it's expensive, but I'm having four of us go because I'm literally forcing them to go with me because it's like technically my birthday tomorrow and I'm like, please hang out with me. So I'm making Alicia, Remy, and my friend Angie come and Angie's the friend of mine that I actually play tennis with. 
Remy and Alicia have tried to get to play tennis with me 80 million times. <laughs> it never works out, but I think that they're rallying because it's my birthday. Whatever it takes. I'm going into work after this and I need to pick up the scorecards that I made. I, I'm gonna explain all my birthday stuff later, probably tomorrow. I got scorecards made because each stop of the way of my birthday, there's a par, like drinking wise. So it'll be like the par is two shots. And in golf, you want to score either par or below. And then tonight I'm going out to dinner with Ashley and Alicia. I decided to do like a small dinner with just with my sisters, just because I'm doing such like a big thing tomorrow. I'm like, I don't want to make people like come to like 80 million things for my birthday. Just like one big one I'm fine with. I'll make my sisters come to everything else. <laughs> but I'm excited honestly, like to have just like alone time with Alicia and Ashley. Cause I feel like we very rarely get it. And if we do, it's like about work or it's like last minute so it'll be fun because like I don't know I've been looking forward to this and I'm really excited because I'm going to one of my favorite restaurants in Beverly Hills which is where I went funny enough for the credit card swap it's called Avra and it's like this Mediterranean spot I forking love it I just love it because it's like healthy but also so filling and good y'all yeah, my buddies made it to tennis we made it. <laughs> Hi. how are you guys doing so far loving it living it hitting the ball <laughs> Angie we're doing great Angie's hungover we're surviving <laughs> Kendall Jenner of you. I know. <laughs> Wait, I'm scared. Don't be, don't be, don't be. Versace. Am I a Versace? <laughs> hey y'all! Happy mother forking birthday to me! What's up, dirty forkers? Welcome back to the juice box. I am so excited for today. I'm just like already having the best time. It's my 25th birthday on the 25th of June, golden year by the way. It's gonna be lit. I'm so excited about the theme. I'm so excited about my party. I love hosting. I love having parties. Wearing a free people short, a Stax top, and some Puma Daddies. And I'm literally just cleaning. Let me show you. I think this is my outfit for today, so I'm leaving that out. This is stuff I'm folding. Need to put away. Need to put away. Need to put away. All this shit is like birthday shit. This is my tripod. Need to put away. The game plan for today Today is I am having everyone come here in pregame at my house at 6 30. I'm gonna put my invite right here it's so forking cute Julia made it and we kind of like brainstormed ideas together and I found like a bunch of inspo and stuff on Pinterest because I've always wanted to do this theme for a party I just didn't know what I honestly never thought it would be my birthday party theme but I love the theme so golf pros and tennis says it is such a fun theme use it for all your little frat parties formals whatever the case is use it birthdays I definitely recommend it it's such a like funny and cute and easy theme. So yes, everyone is dressed up in their best golf pro or tennis hoe attire. If you're a guy, you can be a tennis hoe. If you're a girl, you can be a golf pro. Like there are no gender, like don't even worry about that. Like you can dress however you want tonight, which I'm very excited. I think I'm going to be a tennis hoe. I think everyone's doing a little bit of everything. I can't wait to see everyone like dressed up in their country club attire. I, and my friends, like y'all, my friends go so hard for a theme. Like they nut for a theme, which is so fun. And the game plan is everyone gets to my place at 6.30 for a little pregame, which means everyone will get here at like actually seven. Alicia's coming over here to help with my makeup, I think around like three-ish. And she's gonna, I think, get ready here too. And then my Fitum friends are coming here at five to help me set up, decorate, do all the things. So the thing is, is people are gonna come here to pregame in their attire. And I have a bunch of like fun little gadgets and things that we're gonna do while we're here. Obviously we're gonna drink, listen to music, all the things. I'll show you that in like a second. Y'all, I ordered so much shit. Like I'm so fucking excited about it. I love the little details of the party with party planning. Party bus is picking us up here taking us to then Top Golf, which is in El Segundo. 
there's a brand new Top Golf in LA. I don't think anyone in my group has been to it yet, so we're so freaking excited. I've been to Top Golf in Indiana, but never in LA, so so excited about that. I rented out four bays, and everyone gets food and everything. You can drink whatever. It's so fun. And we're gonna golf for like two hours, and then we're gonna take the bus again, party bus, all the way to West Hollywood. I know it's a lot of driving. That's just how LA is and how the shit worked. We're going to Nightingale, which is a club here in LA. It's actually a really fun club. It slays. And they were so kind to comp me a table for me and my guests. And we're just going to go rage there in our golf gear. It'll be so funny. Everyone's going to be there in their tight dresses. And we're going to be literally in golf gear. So slay. I think it's so fun having a theme that is like easy for everyone to do. Because pretty much everyone I know like has at least one like collared shirt. And lots of girls like tennis is so trendy. Like lots of girls have like athletic wear or like a tennis skirt or something they can put together. If not like. A quick Amazon purchase will do the trick and everyone like it's cute or you can just wear a hat like it's not that deep sweater vest whatever you have I think it'll be so funny like all of us like dressed up like country club like girlies just like raging in a party bus and like at a club I don't know I think it'll be so funny my acne is kind of making me a little bit insecure but you know what I woke up in a great mood I'm gonna go for a walk I'm back on my workout grind whatever also I'm good at hiding it with makeup and Alicia Marie is doing my eyes which means I'm gonna look forking fabulous Okay, I have so many updates. First of all, Benefit Forking Cosmetics sent me this. I literally am obsessed with them. I love them so much. Benefit Cosmetics is my favorite beauty brand, I think. They have such good products, and this is not an ad. I, I need to stop doing an ad right now, but I forking love them. Wow. My friend here on YouTube, and just in real life, but you guys know her from YouTube, Brooke. Forking Michio, my ride or die queen, I love this bitch, started a fundraiser with Planned Parenthood to raise 50K and we're almost at 50K and I was like, bitch, change it to 100K, it's my birthday. <laughs> I just started posting like crazy. I was like, guys, if you wanna give me a present, donate to Planned Parenthood. Because of all of this shit that's going on, I didn't realize yesterday when I woke up, our literal world would be changing and going back like 80 million years. Don't even get me started on it because it just makes me so sad and upset and just like, I, the fact that women don't have control over their own bodies is mind boggling to me. Anyway, we'll talk about that in another time, but I will try and link the fundraiser down below, if not the link to Planned Parenthood. So definitely donate even like one to five to 10 to $20, like whatever you can, send it to your parents, send it to your loved ones, send it to your boyfriend, your crush, send it to your like sneaky link and be like, you wanna hit it again, donate then. Cause that's what I did. Personally, I did go to the grocery store. I'll show you what I got. Chips, these little like white chocolate covered pretzels, but they have like colorful sprinkles. And then I got some that are like cookies and cream. Sugar cookies, chocolate chip cookies, salsa, more cookies, like pomegranate and cranberry juice for drinks. Some pretzel crisp daddies. Some of these Annie's things. I'm like, I don't know what people are gonna want. We have food coming to Top Golf. So I just wanted like finger food here. Literally so many flowers. I'm gonna make some bouquets to go in my house. Normally I feel like I would have like so much planned during the day and I'm kind of glad I didn't. It's just like, I'm kind of enjoying like cleaning, getting my shit together. I don't know. Maybe this is me getting old, but that Planned Parenthood shit just got me fired up. Something about me, I love giving back. Like, I don't know what it is, but like, I love it. It genuinely makes me so happy. I was a part of a dance marathon growing up, which is like a huge fundraiser for Riley Children's Hospital. And I don't, honestly, I was involved in a lot of like clubs, fundraiser type things. I just love like being a part of a team and helping like a greater cause so yeah I would love to do something like with my channel doing a big fundraiser like I think that's why I'm so obsessed with Ryan Trahan's like penny series because of like the whole fundraiser thing I don't know he's just like it's inspiring me a lot and I'm like I can do a lot with my following and my channel so I'm like let me know if you have any any ideas because I would love to do something for this like planned parenthood shit I really would let's put the shit away Okay, these are all the ones I made from home. So adorable, so easy. I mean, I'm literally obsessed. Y'all, my management just sent the cutest cupcakes I've ever seen from Sprinkles. I am so grateful for my team. These smell so forking good. Seriously, like 
I cannot emphasize enough or even explain how much I am grateful for my team and my management. Like I would not be working with any of the brands that I'm working with or doing like half the things that I get to do doing this job without my team and I'm so grateful for them. I'm just so grateful. I feel so loved today. I love y'all. Y'all are the best. I wouldn't be able to do any of this shit. Like even going and buying all this shit, like throwing this party, like I wouldn't be able to do it without you guys. So seriously, I have butterflies and rainbows and flowers all within me today. You guys mean the world. Thank you. Alicia and secret boyfriend just got here. Well, Ashley is not Alicia's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna reveal this flag that I just got and he's gonna give me his oh. reaction. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Isn't it so funny? I love. That's incredible. This, this is a scorecard for everywhere we're going. Epic. And there's a par. So like at the juice box, the par is five. And on the back, one mixed drink and two shots. You have to have. Uh-huh. And everyone has a lanyard to like wear it. Amazing. And then the penalties are, if you're not dressed on thing, plus ten. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> if you're kicked out or cut off, uh -huh. plus six. <laughs> Throws up, <laughs> plus four. Face times X, plus three. Oh my God, that's so good. drink, plus one. Sits the entire duration of the party bus, plus two. And complains, plus 13. Bonus, if you do a dance floor makeout. That means minus eight. Okay, um, so you get out there. All right. Gets free drink from someone, minus two. Takes a really cute photo of TK, minus five. Oh, bitch, I'm a win. Gets hot person's number, okay, minus okay. three. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Isn't that funny? Those are, these are great. I'm so excited. This grass, you know, for a table runner. Oh, I love that. <laughs> But these balls say, let's fork and go at TK's Juicy Bowls, 1997. <laughs> then I got everyone custom cups. Wait. This says golf pros and tennis hoes and everyone gets one. And on the back, it's from Sausalito Creations, says TK's 25th, 1997. Wow. Ugh, so sick of cleaning. I hate cleaning. I like to clean and I cannot lie. <laughs> I'm a man with a plan and a man on my cage. I'm a mean streets wild boy. I look a little crazy right now, but my fit and friends are here to help me set up, and I have teeth whitening strips in, so I have a lisp. That's why. Hey, y'all. Hey! Say hey to the dirty forkers. Hey, hey dirty forkers. forkers. <laughs> Dirty forkers. Dirty so I'm gonna give everyone a job because they're like creative little girlies. So I need this flag right. hung right here. Oh, of course. It's like a, it's like a prop. <laughs> so there's these, and then there's green ones. So maybe do like half and half. Guys, Alicia's doing my makeup because she is so slay at it and so kind to do so. I've been thinking I should listen to my left brain. I've been speeding like I'm living in the left lane. It's getting out of control. So we're on Expo Marker Duty on to the mirrors. <laughs> you want to ride something weird? Grab your balls and party. <laughs> and party? <laughs> dress, tennis dress that I obviously love. I'm wearing these New Balance shoes, Hanes socks, and then how cute is this little polo sweater? It's from their Wimbledon collection. I ended up going with the tennis dress, and then I'm wearing a Wilson visor, and then I have a shit ton of jewelry on. Most of these bracelets are sporty and rich, which they were so kind to gift me. I'm literally obsessed with them. This one says healthy. And then this one has a little tennis racket, which I'm just like beyond obsessed with. I literally love my outfit. I feel so comfortable, which is like 
the goal. And I can't wait to be like dancing at a club in like sneakers and a tennis dress. This is my ideal club attire. Hey y'all, so I'm peeing. Slay. Slay, just peed. Feeling great. I had a Celsius before this, so y'all know I feel great. I love all my tripod. People are gonna be like, what is this decor? I'm not, I don't even care to move it. Box that lens. Shut up. <laughs> Take his tequila ball. That is the funniest shit I've ever. Were they I'm like one that? in your mouth all night? No, thank you. No, okay. she didn't care. Gift She's from like, Trevor. Give me that money. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, happy birthday. Oh my god, I'm tired. Hey yo, house tour, slay. Like, what? <laughs> this is a shot glass. Ew. Like, this is a mess. So, <laughs> such a mess. 
I am dead. Slay. for sponsoring this video and don't forget to use my promo code Taylor K for $20 off if you spend over a hundred dollars you will not regret it trust me I cannot wait to go to bed in these amazing sheets tonight